Hey you, good morning. You ready for this? I don't mean the move. I know you're ready for that. Way past ready, honestly. No, I mean the packing. You ready to tackle this place? <laughs> oh yeah? Really? Yeah, well, you think you don't have much, but take it from me. Once you start packing, you discover just how much stuff you have. It's always a lot more than you think. Sweetness, you will be amazed at how fast we can fill a box and it won't even look like we made a dent. Plus, there's the inevitable delay when you find something you haven't seen in years, which is always so much fun, but usually burns some time. And all the dust we're going to be stirring up digging through stuff, it's a lot. It'll probably take about twice as long as we think, if we're lucky. That's why you have me. With my help, we'll get it done as fast as possible. I'm a moving expert, remember? Oh yeah, total pro. Pretty soon this will all be packed up. And then we can start loading the truck and get everything over to the new place. Which, in traffic, should only take about 45 minutes, maybe an hour. Easy peasy. But first, come here. Listen, moving is a giant pain in the ass, I know that. But I also know you're ready to be out of here. And I'm really excited to help. And when the dust settles, I'm so psyched that you'll finally be on my side of town. Imagine not having to drive an hour to come see each other. Mmm, this is going to be great. But first, we need to get all your things into boxes. Where are... Oh, very nice. That's a lot of boxes ready to go. You saved us a step getting them assembled. Thank you. There's a strategy to it, at least the way I do it. I suggest we make three categories. Everything we touch will go into one of those three categories. The first category is stuff that's coming with you. So the stuff there will get wrapped and packed in the boxes for the move. The second category is donation stuff. The stuff we put there will be things that are in good shape, but you just don't want them anymore. So we can bag them up and donate them later. And the third category will be trash. That should basically cover everything. Make sense? Awesome. Oh, do you have markers so we can write what's in the boxes? The more detailed, the better. Oh, nice. Perfect. Yeah, I never just write kitchen or whatever. That's infuriating when you get somewhere and you have eight boxes labeled kitchen and all you want is to find your coffee maker. I'll try to make sure each box is very thoroughly labeled as we go. Right. Last thing. Are there any areas that you really don't want me to mess with? Stuff that's private or personal or something like that. No, I know, and I appreciate that we're always honest with each other, but that doesn't mean you don't still have a right to privacy. Your things are yours. If there are boundaries I should be aware of, just let me know, okay? All right, I guess we should dive in. Where do you want to start? Closet it is. Lead the way, sweetness. Okay, what do we have here? Are any of these shoes headed to the donator trash pile? Okay, I'll start putting them into a box. Let me grab some paper. I'll separate them a bit so they don't scuff each other up. Yep, yeah, I got this. What are you going to focus on? Awesome. We might need to get a taller box for the tennis stuff. Did you get a few different sizes of box? Perfect. You're already good at this. Ooh, these are nice. I like these shoes. Yeah, I do. How come you don't wear them very often? I get you. Maybe we should make some more occasions then. I mean, you always look good, but you look extra nice dressed up. There's some nice places we could go that won't be far from home once you're settled. Maybe we can go out for a celebratory dinner or something. Mmm, 
Here, I don't know what's in this shoe box, but it's not shoes. All yours. Oh yeah? What is it? Really? I didn't know you took art. One year of art is still taking art. It counts. What all did you keep? Oh, these are nice markers. I wonder if they're still any good. Let's check. Uh, yep, they still work. Definitely bring those. What's that? Did you draw this? It's so good. I just had no idea you were so talented. Why are you hiding this stuff in a box in the closet? I get that. You know how critical I am of my own creations, so I definitely understand. But some of these are really, really good. Maybe we could frame a couple for the new place. If you're okay with it, of course. Absolutely. Pack it all up. We'll sort it out when we get there. Wow, only a few minutes in and I'm already learning so much. <laughs> this is fun. I like helping. Hmm? Oh, I'm shaking the shoes out before I put them in the box. Don't want any little critters coming along for the ride. Some of these have been sitting here a while. I don't think of everything, but I try to. Helps to be prepared. Okay, I think that's just about all the shoes, at least for in here. You don't really have that many. I think there's room in the box for a couple of coats or something. Yeah, sure, it's not that heavy yet. Here, lift real quick. Yeah, see, we can get that up and downstairs without a problem. Hand me a couple of those jackets. You won't need them until it gets colder anyway. There we go. Okay, I think this box is full. I'm going to go ahead and write what's in it on the top and side, but I'm not going to seal it yet, just in case we have stuff to add or move around later. Yeah, you never know. I'll just close the flaps and start a pile of completed boxes in the corner over here. Probably the best spot, don't you think? Yeah, me too. Okay, here we go. There, first box done. Ta-da! <laughs> this pile is going to get so big, but we are off to a good start. I think I'll take on this bookshelf next, if you're good with that. Yep, point me toward the smaller boxes, the book ones. Thank you. Do you have a preference for these? Like, do you want certain books to stay together, like all the fantasy in one box and all the nonfiction in another? Or do you not care as long as it all fits? Works for me. Hang on, I need to grab a thing. Ah, a Swiffer cloth. I want to dust them as I put them in the box. I know, right? I'm always surprised how dusty books can get. Like, they're books. Whatever, this is a good chance to clean them up. Oh, don't worry. Books get special treatment. I'll make sure they don't get knocked around too hard. Hey, I got you. You're like me. We both have a very healthy respect for books. Oh, have you read this? I love this series. So good. Hey, I think this one is mine. Yes, huh? I loaned you this. No fair keeping my books on your shelf. <laughs> Sneaky book thief. I'll need to keep an eye on you. What else of mine have you taken? Well, no, you actually did take something. My heart. I know, but you love it. Yes, you do. You love it when I'm sappy. You groan, but you think it's cute. You can't deny it. Shh, just keep packing. We have a lot to do. You have really good taste in books. I mean, I know this about you. This shelf is one of the reasons I fell for you, but it's nice to go through it again and be reminded. This one. This is interesting. Oh, I see. That makes sense. Did you like it? Yeah, I get that. Oh, wow. This one brings back memories. I read this in high school. What did you think of it? 
Honestly, same. I should probably reread it, see if my perspective has changed. Now this, this is a well-loved book right here. No, it's great. You've clearly read it a lot. It looks like you carried it with you places. It's kind of beautiful, honestly. It shows how much it means to you. This book got some use, and that's why books exist. It's lovely. <laughs> no, you. Okay, I think this box can't take any more books. It's getting heavy. Uh, yeah, no more books. Let me find a few light things to top it off. Maybe... Huh, maybe some small towels? Yeah, that'll work. Thank you. Okay, let's label it. And that's another down. We are schmoovin'. How's that one coming? Nice! The box pile grows. Do you want me to keep going with the books, or do you want to take over that part? Up to you. I can move on to the stuff on the shelf if you like. The smaller framed pictures and figures and stuff. Oh yeah, that's what the bubble wrap is for. I'll make sure all of it is really well wrapped. And I'll label the box fragile too, just in case. Perfect. I'll do that then. Have I ever told you how much I love this picture of you? It's the cutest. You were what, ten? Ah, adorable. You look like you want to murder your brother, but you're still so damn cute. Yes, you are. You're even cuter now, actually. Ah, oh, can I make you blush? Maybe I should try. Nah, I'll take pity. But I'll also take a kiss, though. Mwah. Thank you. I love that you keep this picture on display. Hmm? Oh, okay. But just a couple of pops. If you pop all the bubbles, it's not bubble wrap, it's just a sheet of plastic. And that doesn't protect anything. There you go. Get it out of your system. <laughs> okay, back to work, you. These books won't box themselves. You're doing great, by the way. Well, I know we're just getting started, but you're doing great. What can I say? I like the way you put things in boxes. Huh, this better not awaken something in me. <laughs> oh, before I forget, did you want to order pizza for lunch? Yeah, that works for me. Pizza just kind of goes with moving. Plus, we won't have to use any of the kitchen stuff to eat it. Which is good, because I'm hoping most of it's in boxes by then. Awesome. We can get it from that place down the street that you like. Well, last day in the old place. we got to get the good pizza one more time. That's a no-brainer. What else do you think you'll miss about living here? Of course there are some things. I know you're glad to be moving, and the new place is a definite step up, but there'll be things you miss. That's just normal. Yeah, the pizza for sure. What else? Oh, good point. Although the new place seems to have decent water pressure too, so hopefully that won't be too big a change. Anything else? You know you're right. I'll miss that too. Sure, this place definitely has some upsides, and of course, some really nice memories. Hmm, I remember kissing you for the first time right outside this building. That's a memory to hold on to. Yes, huh, it was down on the street just below here. I remember it very clearly. No, that wasn't our first kiss, that was our second. But I can see why you could get them confused. You think so? You really want to fight me on this? Good, because I'd win. I have the better memory here, hands down. Of course. There would be zero way to prove either of us right, but I'd still fight you to the end. <laughs> oh, this figure. I love it. You painted this one, right? So pretty. I should have known about that hidden art talent all along. It was hiding in plain sight. 
I've got it nicely wrapped. Don't you worry, sweetness. Your things are precious to me because you are precious to me. I'll be very, very careful. Always. I think after this shelf, I'll start in the kitchen. I know, but it's like a behemoth crouching in the corner. I need to take it on. It's personal. Nah, I just like wrapping mugs in bubble wrap. It's satisfying. <laughs> okay, well, you keep on that section, and I'll meet you in the kitchen when you're done. Sound good? Awesome. We'll be done in no time. And after that, on to bigger and better things. Hey, sweetness. If you like what you hear, don't forget to click subscribe so you can hear more. Also, check me out over on Twitch. And if you want to support me, Patreon. Thanks for listening.